Hey guys, so today we are here to talk about something, a topic that I think I've always mentioned, I think quite a bit, and it's how the admins kind of communicate with the player base when updates come out. So if you guys happen to enjoy this little discussion, maybe think about leaving a like on the video and maybe commenting either how you feel about it or what you'd like to see next. So if you guys don't know, uh, you know, I'll try to include the link for it in the description. Don Breeze the other day made a forum post being like, hey, there is, you know, we're making a new big content update, and this is why Rev5 has been delayed, essentially, right? And I know it's a big shame that Rev5 is delayed and all, but I mean, if you think about it, it's not that bad. Because pretty much how it ends up being is, you know, we are getting this big, supposedly big content update. And the fact that they are choosing or they are now communicating with us about new update stuff is fairly interesting, if you ask me. Because I, one of my biggest gripes was they never told us what was going on, you know, what they're working on. I mean, they're not telling us what they're working on other than that it's an island, but not an island. But, you know, the fact that they're taking this step forward to be like, hey guys, we're actually doing this, and this is why this is delayed. I think it's a very good step in the right direction. Since, you know, I it's just I really like the idea of having the you know the admins communicate with the players. Since if the players don't know what's going on, don't know what to look forward to, you know, like what or where are our hopes really gonna lie, I guess you could really say. So, you know, I really hope going forward they keep up this, you know, all right, let's you know, talk to the players or give some information to the player base so they know what to look out for and, you know, how things are going pretty much. Because if, again, we don't know what's going on, people could maybe like lose interest. And it just, to me, I think it's just something that would generate hype. Now, I know that's kind of like an iffy topic, like people like, you know, being surprised and stuff, but also kind of knowing what's coming, knowing things are coming. That's like, hey, they're working on stuff and it's coming very soon. Now, you know, very soon is uh, an interesting word, you know, very soon could mean weeks, could mean months, you know, we don't know how long very soon is. So, you know, again, I don't know how that new update is going to stack up to Rev 5, but, you know, again, it's just kind of uh, some quick little thoughts about it and all, but I'm just happy that they're making that stuff. Since, you know, maybe next time there's another, like, big content drop, they'll maybe tell us more about it and let us know. But again, I think they still need to work on the vagueness because I don't understand why they're making that kind of post. And at the same time being like, hey, we're making this post, but it still might be delayed, so don't get hyped. I just like, why make the post then? You know, like, if, if it's not actually coming without in, like, the next week or something, you know, uh... What's the point of being like, working on something, that's why it's not coming, but it's still going to be delayed. Just be like, hey, we're uh, busy doing something, smiley face. Not just, you know, they give us a reason and kind of really weird, but I, I don't know. Again, I, I just like everything to be like optimal and perfect where just like we know everything. I think a roadmap would be a great addition. I'm sure a lot of people would agree with this, like, I feel like roadmap because the game, you know, we don't know what's coming, right? Anything could be coming. Who knows? Like, they probably have really big plans, but now that they have their monetization and stuff, they can definitely act on these plans a lot more, which I think is nice, I guess you could say. But again, I think I'll, you know, we received multiple updates over the last few weeks. And I think as we go into 2021, we'll be receiving probably maybe a monthly update, even maybe an update every two weeks. So I think that would be pretty cool. And, you know, I'm looking forward to that. And I'm looking forward to hopefully the one or two updates left this year. Hopefully it's two, but it's definitely at least one. Anyway, I don't want to drag this on too long. It's so just a quick little discussion on that whole forum post. And again, if you guys didn't see that video, I'll probably include the link in the description so you can, you know, see what's going on with that. Anyway, thank you guys for watching. Maybe leave a sub or like video. Repeat it a second time. Smiley face. Anyway, take care, guys. Bye.